Right, stay where you're at. We're getting back to those hits in a moment. We've got Ed Sheeran, Jax Jones, and a brand new weekend tune, which is worth staying there for. It's epic. It's next. <laughs> KMFM is the regional FM broadcaster for Kent. KMFM is actually an amal amalgamation of several smaller independent radio stations that have been brought together. Uh, KMFM has been uh, has been fun. So I've been here uh, a while now. We started the journey kind of six, seven years ago. Uh, where they were seven individual FM stations and one DAB. Uh, and then we've been kind of uh, consolidating that and trying to improve the content, but also obviously the commercial appetite for it as well. KMFM uh, broadcasts out to eight separate transmitter sites. Uh, traditionally, these have been linked to the studios by Killerstream circuits, which are analog copper-based circuits. The, the changes were in the telecoms industry rather than the radio industry. BT were withdrawing the support and installation for X21 circuits, which means if anything goes wrong with those circuits, you will not get that fixed. We were put in a position where by the end of March this year, we've had to migrate away from X21 analog circuits into an MPLS digital circuit. Um, a lot of radio stations traditionally might break out into analog um, even before um, the audio actually gets delivered to the transmitter site. Um, psychologically, for a listener, um, having an all-digital workflow up until the transmitter means that we can deliver the cleanest audio. Uh, the audio leaves the studio here uh, in Kent. Um, it goes through our virtualized uh, audio network, um, which is an all-digital, uh, all-IP-based network. Um, it then gets processed by our virtualized uh, systems here and then gets delivered digitally over the beaming network uh, to each individual transmitter site. We chose Beaming a lot. The reason is because uh, they came up with a really solid design for our network, giving us resilience that we need. Obviously, radio station broadcasting 24-7. You need a network that's going to be up for 24-7. You can't have a fibre going down and, and then broadcasting silence. So Beaming came up with a design that gave us a uh, solid, fiber network backed up by uh, a broadband network if a fiber breaks then uh, that's automatically uh, re-diverted out through the ftTC network so you never lose any transmission why should you improve FM because it, it it realistically isn't going anywhere anytime soon being able to have that IP direct into the transmitter sites be able to process all of the, the radio stations in the same way means that as you drive around the county KMFM is now one of the loudest radio stations, if not uh, the loudest radio station um, in the county, which was one of the things that was really important to us. I think we've been able to create something that's not only sounding amazing, which from a listener experience is really important, uh, is stable, which is the commercial element, but also being able to go home at night knowing that everything is rock solid and having the redundancy there that's instant. I mean, it, yeah, there's so many pros for this system. Yeah, It's been pretty cool.